Um, I, I'm trying to make this as brief as, as I can. Um, I don't satisfy myself with understanding that the corner angle view, the corner angle views, views that crisscross these main squares of the edge on views in these cubicle cells, these X pieces, need to be half their size. I don't know if you can see that, but I drew, I drew a diagram out, and I figured out that for the same space as a squared image that needs to be on all of them, um, I don't know if you can understand this any, but, uh, see, here's the seven lines that crisscross each other for the edge on views, the straight views. And then these are the these what represent the X's, the X pieces inside each cubicle cell wall walls, four walls going around. Well, in order to have the same space, the same squared space for the same size picture to be sliced up, they would have to be half their size, half the size of the cubicle cell walls, the cubicle cell walls would be a full one inch on this model. So that means that these um, X pieces would have to be half an inch in height. And um, it's serendipitous in that um, it's favorable to allow the edge on views to have more prominence while sinking in the corner angle views, these X pieces by half an inch to the inch wide, inch height of the cubicle cells going crisscross. There are seven of those going crisscross, and but there's 11 of these X pieces going crisscross. There's X, or there's seven slates all together, or louvers, whatever going criss or 11 of them going crisscross to the seven of the edge on views. So that means they have to be cut in half. And there's only two positions for these X pieces. Either they're high up on top, level with the rest of the edge on views, or they're sunken down by half an inch. And it makes more sense to be serendipitous for the serendipity of the design to be sunk down and half and half by half an inch because that naturally allows for the um, edge on views to have more prominence as you're going around the model and um, so in short what this means is that I'm gonna have to take these are glued in all these uh, X pieces are glued in at a single axis and the top piece wherever that's at, the, the top part, the top end is allowed to come out in order to be able to fit your fingers inside here to paste images to all the walls. And you can put images on here and put it back in, slide it back in. But now it appears I'm gonna have to un, somehow unglue all these, which I can, I can do easy and glue them all, pull all these X pieces out, cut them at half their size, and put them back in, and glue them near the bottom of each cubicle cell wall, because that's, that's the most favorable design serendipitously of having the edge on views, given the, having the corner angle views, given, given the, edge on views an equal prominence as you make your way around the model and I know it doesn't look great right now but it will um, I just got to do all these small things in turn to uh, give it the best serendipitous design I guess that these corner angle views offer and um, here's the sketch I did last night if that if you can understand that well thanks a lot